hell of an office one. In Afghanistan, I smoked a cigar. The pony shit left my voice a little hoarse. <laughs> uh, one dot of the game. Danny, back for more chaos, I see. So many fun ways to fuck up Soldado. Choose when you die, just how many you take with you. Ah, my favorite guerrilla. Want me to make you the best supremos and resolver weapons? You'll be back. They always come back. Once you're back at Santuario, shake the trees for guns, ammo, new believers. Cassio was surprised. Let's keep it that way. Welcome to Libertad, Danny. You can leave any time. What's the rush? Inspiring. Let's free Yara, shall we? Castillo controls all of Yara with soldados, slaves, and blood. The capital is a stronghold. We take Esperanza, we free Yara. Best chance we got to weaken Castillo is to hit military targets like FND bases and checkpoints. But most important, we have to surround Esperanza and trap Castillo in his cage. That means targeted operations that will unite the revolution and make Libertad stronger. To do that, I need you to recruit three groups in Yara to fight with Libertad. Each is waging war across Yara with a different piece of Castillo's empire, all controlled by his inner circle. In El Este, foreign invaders like Mickey Industries suck our resources dry, and Admiral Benitez defends Castillo's poison lifeline. But the old legends of 67 can help us turn the tide. They're hiding in the jungles of the highest mountains of Yara. Their greatest guerrilla, El Tigre, is waiting with open arms to help you bring them on our side. Then we have Valle de Oro. Not just the engine of Castillo's Viviro operation, but also his propaganda machine, run by his Minister of Culture, Maria Marquesa. But I have some old friends who can run our counter-propaganda campaign, Maximas Matanzas. They were the voice of the protests and can mobilize Yara's dissidents to fight for Libertad. They've gone dark. Last seen at a fort in Balaceras. We need to find them before Castillo's forces do. In Madrugada, we have Castillo's nephew, Jose, a slave driver who forces outcasts to grow that poison Viviro tobacco. But the Montero family is waging war against Jose. They hate visitors, but I have intel on a mechanic who has a workshop in Costa del Mar. His name is Fili Barzaga, and he's their gatekeeper. If I were you, Danny, I'd start in Madrugada. We take back that tobacco with the Montero's help, and we got Castillo's Viviro at the source. You just need to find this mechanic, Philly. I'll be here actioning targeted Libertad strikes against Castillo throughout Yara. Hang on. I'm going to get all these groups to sign up to Libertad by myself? How? Simple. You help. Any way you can. I send a squad to these groups, I'm an invader. I send a scout, then I'm not serious. With you, they get my best career without politics and bullshit. Just help. 
Libertad takes the capital, we slit Anton's throat, maybe drink his blood, etc., etc. Then he needs a walk. Viva Libertad, Fa! Yeah, yeah. I'm not Clara's best guerrilla. You are. You're not listening. Translate one. The accent. Clara hides it best she can, but she was born rich. From a family of true Yaren she left behind. She can shoot, bleed, drink with us all she wants. But she can't hide the stink of the upper class. What's that have to do with me? You are an orphan, Danny. Poor. From the dirt. When they see you, they don't see politics. They see they have no excuse. She's using me. See? And you're using her right back. Do you want to kill Anton? See. Si. You want to free Yara? Sure you do. But here's what Clara can't say, but you and I both know. You want this. You're a guerrilla. And for a guerrilla, the shit my pants rush of an ambush, the smell of sulfur burning your nostrils, it's... It's... It's fun. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. Especially trained and heavily armed. Fuck you, smartass. But yes, you've been warned. Oye, Clara, I'm on my way to Valle de Oro. Good. I hope you find Maximus Matanzas. How do you know them, anyway? Talia and I led the first protests against Castillo, while Paolo mobilized the dissidents. We lost contact after the Esperanza riots. I saw those riots. A lot of people got hurt. This is the fort. Looks like no one has been here for a hundred years. Hey! Uh, Maximus Matanzas! Dahlia! This one. Maybe they left a note. They wanted others to follow. Clara. Maximus Matanzas was definitely at the fort. There's signs of a gunfight and shit thrown everywhere. That sounds like them. Can you pick up their trail? See? They won't be hard to track. That's what I'm worried about. Rapido, Danny. It's 
squatter. Looks like you were in the wrong place at the wrong time. Try to run with that, idiotas. Todo tranquilo. Cambio. Hostages. Gracias, gracias. You got it. I know that song. Cojone. I'm not the first to find them. Pinga. Hope I'm not too late. Officer. Have to be careful. Oye, Clara. Think I found Maximus Matanzas' hiding spot. But Castillo's soldados got here first. Looks like they're having some fun before they call for backup. You know what to do, Danny. Whatever it takes. Careful, princess. You will ruin your singing voice. Encuéntralo ahora mismo. Sin excusa. Alerta. Que aún siguen aquí.
That's the last of them. Or what, carajo? Ah, ping! You must be Dahlia. Move. What the fuck? Hey, uh, you think I could keep this? No, yes. Hey, man, you just saved Maximus Matanzas, the most blessed motherfucking group in Yara. Though I would have done it myself personally, but you know, I couldn't stop crying. Get out of my way. I'm Bicho, man. I'm from Mexico. Get me the fuck out of here. I know you can hear me. If I let you out, you're gonna behave? Mi amor. Fuck, Italia. Oh, I thought you wanted to hide like a pussy-ass bitch. You want to die before we get to America? Oh, big man, Palo. So a real man takes care of his chica by hiding her in a stank-ass swamp. Fucking puta. Coño. <laughs> That's just foreplay. <laughs> okay, okay. You guys ever heard of Libertad? Clara Garcia sent me. We were Libertad before Libertad. Who do you think dragged Clara to her first protest when she wanted to live in a fucking library? I don't care. Clara knows her boring ass speeches won't convince Yarns to join Libertad. She needs her voice. Don't worry, Talia's full of shit, and so are you. Welcome to Camp Maximus. <laughs> <laughs> They're animals. Everybody! So those are gone! Come on out! American weapons. Shit. Libertad could use those. Should check it out. Hola. Hey. Juan. Got a lead on a weapon ship. American. Interested? Inter You're still full of shit. A lot more people here than I thought. Are they musicians too? Talia collects dreamers dumb enough to pick fights with Anton's Ministry of Culture. I just make sure they aim the barrel away from the face. Thought I was the only dropout. Papa was a drill instructor. Family's fifth gen army until me. What happened? Expelled. When Papa found out I turned from his favorite daughter into a freak. His words. Shit. Just trans in the military, compai. I was lucky. Talia caught me trying to steal her gear, but instead of turning me in, she gave me a deck. Libertad can help all of you here. Libertad? When Castillo won, we left riots with Clara. And what did he get us? Clara runs off to play guerrilla, Talia gets thrown into Maria Marquesa's bullshit academy, and I have to take a big fucking debt to get her out. From who? Bembe, black market smuggler. Once he's paid off, Talia and I are off this fucking rock. Let me take some debt, Paolo. I don't do handouts. Okay. Why'd you leave the military? Punch my drill instructor in the throat. I'm not a morning person. Segunda, 
Ben Bet deals in the church. Interested? Daddy, I'm having a... Hands-free orgasm in this church. Call me when you find them. Gross? Oh, yeah. Okay. Clara, good news. Maximus Matanzas is safe, and they've actually got a decent camp here. Bad news, they don't give a shit about Libertad. It's a gamble. Give it time, Danny. They've been through a lot. We can't beat Castillo without Talia's voice and Paolo's discipline. You just need to help them find it. Okay, Clara. I'm going to start by finding... ...my way around this camp. See what they've done with the place. Suerte, Danny. So now you want to talk to me? No, I want to see you. Meet me at the Suval Abatidora, the ride that whips you around. Look, if this is some kind of fucked up date. Just get that ass over here. And don't tell Paolo. He'll drag me back to that fucking swamp.
need to help Paolo pay off a debt to some black market smuggler named Bembe. Do whatever it takes, Danny. If Paolo was able to build that camp on the run, imagine what he could do for Libertad when he decides to fight. Understood, Clara. Hola. Is this Yami? Found your number on a poster about racing. Oh, if you like racing, you call the right number. We do it guerrilla style. Each track is marked with checkpoint flares you gotta drive through. Try to beat the best time. You in? Fuck it. I'll try it. That's the racing spirit right there. I like you already. Suerte! <gasps> from the riot in Esperanza are hiding out somewhere in the swamp. You Bembe? I know a silly when I see one. What is wrong with Ola, asshole? You tried to fuck me, Danny Rojas. I saw your organs to the Yankees. I know. If I shoot you, Malo's death disappears. No. You have rules. You might kill, but you're no killer. Mierda. You got me. So what does that make you? I kill guerrillas. I also kill soldiers. It's just business. Easy to pretend you're not picking sides. My father was a guerrilla in 67. After the revolution, he put on a crisp military uniform. Thirty years later, to his surprise, a fresh new revolution with fresh new guerrillas. They thank him with a bullet to the skull, buried in the same crisp uniform. Are you ready for your uniform, Rojas? Goes both ways. How's that? You were just dressed like a priest. <laughs> I like you, Danny Rojas. We can do business. Fucking down there. Okay, Rojas. I need you to pick up my key from my business partners. Where are they? At the hotel. My associates are named Dimitri and Vasily. They're Russian and they're twins. I'll make it easy and send a picture. You're too kind. They say kindness is the lowest form of manipulation. This is a simple job, Rojas. Get me my key, and Paolo will thank you. I don't want Paolo's thanks. I want Paolo's debt cleared. We all do it, Ross. Me most of all. Right. I'll get you this key. But then you and Paolo are square. Understand? Love you, Ross. Bye-bye.
izquierda. Don't help people, Bembe. You use them. I'll take that as a thank you. I wonder what will happen if the animal... Soldiers. Simple job, my ass. Nothing there. What do you want? Are you Dimitri or Vasily? Dimitri? Who the fuck are you? Bembe sent me. Where's the key? <laughs> so that's what this is about. Bembe fucked us good. First he sends military, then he sends you. I don't work for Bembe. I'm just here for the key. My brother has the key. The soldiers drowned him like a dog, but he didn't once beg for his life. He died in that fancy pool like a man. My Vasily. Gracias. I'm sorry about your brother. I'm getting out of Yara. You should too before Bembe stabs you in the back. Idiota Kusok! I never should have come to this godforsaken country! Bembe! You fucking hijo de puta! So you got my key. See, I found it on your dead Russian friend. Now, Rojas, the key opens a 
safe at Via Hudia Hotel. I need a black book inside. What's in that book? For you? Paolo's freedom. <laughs> 